Uh, my name is uh, Kavita Oberoi and um, last week I had an incident with my pressure cooker. I'm a very busy working uh, mom businesswoman, have run my own business and I was actually due to catch a flight to Northern Ireland to speak to an audience of doctors the following day. So um, as part of my day um, I needed to um, make some food for the family whilst I was away. Uh, recently my mother had been visiting and um, she has her pressure cooker that she brought with her. So I got I got the pressure cooker out and I turned it on and um, my mom, I remember my mum saying when it whistles it's ready. It started whistling, it's very very hot inside. So I took it off the stove and I just put it on the side. And then five minutes later I wanted to transfer it into a, another dish. Um, and I tried to open it, it was shut tight because obviously there was pressure in there. I released the pressure through the um, little thing on the top, like the weight on the top, um, and then I could hear a hiss, like it, the pressure's gone. And when I moved it, the, um, it was it was coming ajar. So obviously I thought it's safe to open now. And as I opened, the next thing was a bang. And the food splattered everywhere. Um, the next thing I knew, my face was on fire. It just felt so hot. Um, and I just, I was just thinking, oh my God, my face, my face, my face. And I just put putting water on, I was putting water on, I was running from mirror to mirror, looking at my face. Um, I've got a first aider who works for me, and I rang her and said, you know, Google, what should I do? Um, I nearly put a block of ice on, which would have been the worst thing, because you're not supposed to have fast cooling. And I rang my husband, and he said, just get the ambulance round, and they were very good. They were here very very quickly a paramedic arrived first who was a doctor and he said i'd done all the right things the best thing for a burn is cold water nothing else but cold water